Ken. 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 What happened? Oh, we're not sure. Kate came in from the storeroom and passed out. Simone, do you know what happened? No, Mom. I, I couldn't tell you why Kate fainted. Charity and I just told Chief and Mrs. Bennett that we wanted to get married. And then Kay came in and, you know, Charity told Kay and Kay passed out. Maybe Kay was just overwhelmed with happiness for us. Yeah, right. Kay? Honey, you all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Everybody stay back and just give Kay some air. Simone, this changes everything. You mean you're finally gonna give up on getting Miguel? No. I mean I'm gonna have to get pregnant by him as soon as possible. There's no way I'm gonna let him marry Charity. No way. Uh, are you sure you're okay? I'm fine, Dad. <laughs> Thanks. Good. Now that Kay's all right, we can deal with your little announcement. So you say you've decided to get married? As soon as possible. We were thinking maybe a double ceremony with Ethan and Teresa. And if Luis and Sheridan decide to get married, we can make it a triple wedding. No, you can't get married. Kay, we thought you'd be happy for us. Well, I am, but Charity, we're not even finished with high school yet. How can you guys be thinking about getting married? Yeah, Kay's right. I mean, where are you going to live? And how would you support yourself? We've got all that covered. You know, Charity and I both have full scholarships to college next year. So we can live in the married dorms while we're at school, and over the summer we can work to pay for an apartment. Right, and after we graduate, we'll have jobs. Why don't you just wait till you graduate to get married? I mean, there's no need to rush anything. Eve's right. You guys are so young. I think you're making a mistake. We aren't making a mistake, Coach Russell. I, we love each other. We're soulmates. Yeah, well, I know that you think that you are now. But when you're young, your judgment is, is, is not what it should be. And you think that you know the person and that's the one you want to be with, but sometimes it doesn't turn out that way. I never met anyone like you. You can fight me, but I know you want me as much as I want you, don't you, Eve? Don't you? Eve, are you all right? I'm sorry. It's just, you know, I, I see so many young people at the hospital who've made bad decisions, and I, I don't want Charity and Miguel to become part of the ranks. No, we won't let that happen. Celebrating our love by getting married is not a bad decision. Please, just give us your blessing. I'm sorry, we can't. We just don't think it's a good idea. But you and Mrs. Bennett see how much we love each other. Oh, we do. It's just that... Well, love can change. Nothing is going to change between me and Charity. Look, let's try to find some middle ground here. Charity, I don't know if you've ever heard me say this to Kay and Jessica, but it's always been Grace's and my policy that as long as the kids live under our roof, they must abide by our rules. But when they turn 18, and if they can support themselves, they can move out of the house and do whatever they want. So you're saying that when Charity turns 18, we can get married? Well, what I'm saying is when you both turn 18, and if you both can support yourselves, well, you can do whatever you want. But we will be there as your family to give you all the support and love that you need. But, and it's still a big but, Grace and I still don't think that you should get married so young. We understand. I mean, but we're going to prove to you all that you're wrong. I mean, Charity and I are in love, and... We're always going to be together. Not only are they not always going to be together, that's one wedding that's never going to happen. I'm going to do whatever it takes to make sure of that. Whatever it takes. As soon as you turn 18, we can get married with your aunt and uncle's blessing. It's really exciting. I can't wait. If they're planning on getting married as soon as she turns 18, I don't have much time. Why can't you just let Charity and Miguel be happy? Simone, you're supposed to be my best friend. What about my happiness? I want you to be happy, Kay. It just seems like every time you scheme to get Miguel, something bad happens. Like selling your soul and ending up in hell. By the way, shouldn't you be concentrating on getting your soul back? 
I can't worry about that right now. I have to find a way to get Miguel in bed and fast. I still can't believe you're gonna try to get pregnant by Miguel. It's the only way to get what I want, Simone. And I want Miguel. I just have to do it fast before she turns 18 and they have a chance to get married. This is wrong, Kay. It's so, so wrong. I know I can seduce him. And once he finds out I'm pregnant, there's no way he'll leave me for charity.